I'm really excited that I have you guys to motivate me to go to this. I would probably just stroll today if I didn't have you guys because I just don't like it. Oh, I need to sleep. Tomorrow I'm sleeping is the day of order. Today we get to move. So Lord, thanks for this great day. Thanks for bodies that can move. Thank you that you are sovereign over all that you're in charge of the nations and our hearts. Lord, we pray that you would come and meet us today as we worship through movement. Shift our perspective to you. You said, set your mind on things above. And you are seated with Christ in heavenly places. Lord, would you reveal to us today what it looks like to think as your daughters? See from your eyes and hear from your ears and love from your heart. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. All right. All right. We're going to start with that. Stretchy kind of flow. All right, so shoulders roll down and back. Begin to deepen your breath. Now turn your palms forward and roll forward. Come back to center. Now swing side to side. Keeping your shoulders relaxed. Lift your chin. Now make it a little bigger. Twist through your feet. Alright, come back to center. Inhale, reach up. Exhale, press your palms down. Cancel. Not talking to you. Cancel up. Exhale, palms down. One more. Press down. Now reach down your right leg. Reach over with your left arm. So inhale, extend, reach. Exhale, back to center. Exhale, other way. Inhale up. Exhale, cactus arms. Inhale up. Exhale, reach over to the right. Kick that left hip far out. Look up. Inhale up. Exhale to the left. Inhale up. Cactus arms. Now from here, twist. So keep your hips square-ish. Twist to the right. Come back to center. Twist to the left. Come back to center. Inhale. Give you a big swoop. Again. Now, forward fold. So let your arms hang. Begin to pedal your feet. So you can raise the floor or not. Inhale, halfway up. Exhale, fold. Grab behind your legs. Pull yourself a little closer. Tuck your chin into your chest and roll it all the way up. Inhale up. Exhale, fold. Inhale, halfway. Exhale, now hands down, step back to your right leg. Come up into a high lunge there with your right leg forward. Palms forward, shoulders down. Good morning, Natalie. Yay, yay. Now open that out. So same leg forward, reach out. Your hips. Or to the side, reach back. Now reach forward. So you can rest your elbow on your knee or reach to the inside of your foot. Reach forward. Take both hands inside. Step forward with your left. Back with your right. Other side. Today we're going to read through the first few verses. Ephesians 2. Reach through your palms. Reach back. Open up your chest. Look up. Reach forward. Now again, elbow on your knee or reach your hand inside. Reach forward. Good. Both hands inside. Step to plank. Drop all the way to the floor. Press up. 
Touch your toes, down dog. We want to train to open our eyes to see you. And as we see you, we will be changed. Bend your knees a lot, look to your hands, step forward. Inhale halfway. Exhale, fold. Roll it all the way up. Inhale up. Exhale, fold. Halfway up. Step back with that left foot. Again, now this time lunge up and down. Getting a little warmer. Open it out. Same thing, up and down. Hold it here. We reverse back. Now bring it forward. Come back up here. Straighten your front leg. Reach forward. And like you're between two panes of glass. Beautiful stretch. Bend your knee a lot. Step to here. You can drop to your back knee if you need to. Now, left hand under your nose, right arm opened up. Both hands down, step forward with your left, back with your right, up and down. So I'm convinced the more that we see him, we will know who we are. And that the more we know who we are, the freer we become. Open it up. Up and down. I want you to think about your greatest insecurities and your deepest fears. And reverse, reach back. The Lord wants to speak to those places to bring security, peace, and freedom. Bring it forward. Reach up and forward. Good job. Keep breathing. Both hands inside. Right hand under your nose. Left arm opens up. Both hands inside. Now wide squat. So as you can sit as low as you want, if you need to be up here, that's good too. Cross. Look over your right shoulder. Switch. 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 And roll it all the way up. Inhale, reach over. Other way. Bring it up. Forward fold. Grab behind your leg. Pull yourself close to your knee. Inhale, halfway up, arms wide. Right hand down. Come back to wide. Left hand down. Come into full reach wide. Now, staying here, toes forward. Come into a really awkward wide squat. Now, both hands down. Come back to plank. Come to your tippy toes and drop low. All the way up, tuck your toes, down up, walk step and hop to the top, inhale all the way up. I already feel better. <laughs> I feel the medicine fog is leaving. All right, give me a job. Ephesians 2 says this You were once dead in your sins and your trespasses in which you once lived, disobedient. Following the enemy. It says you were once by nature children of wrath, but God, who is rich in mercy, who full of love, rescued you. That's good news. Ready? Side to side. You want a little hop? Cross me. Sit low or stay high. Up to you. All right. Squat. Toes wide. All right. Take your toes forward. Butt back. Chest remains open. Sit here. Put your toes forward. Bring them in. Side to side. Try 
Cross knee. Shoulders out of your ear. Narrow squat. Two more. All right, now circle your arms forward. Flex your palms. Go back. All right, lean to the left. Circle that arm. Switch sides. Toes forward, round and arch. Side to side. Cross knee. Now stay crossing your kick. Straight leg. So today we're invited into the butt guard. Give me a squat. Two more. Now circle. This butt God being rich in mercy. Even when we were dead in our sins. Chose us and rescued us. Grab your sticks. So here's the thing. By grace you've been saved. Through faith. Because his response to 
here coming is, she is my delight. There she is. I love her. I'm so glad she's here. Hold. Give me a quarter inch pulses. Loop your shoulders down and back. Take it out. Same thing, little pulses. Oh, I miss you, Wednesday. Hold right, curl out left. Hold left, curl right. So he says, because he's rich in mercy, and because he loves you, he bought you with the blood of Christ. Hold it here, little pulses. Bring it here, upright row. How's your belly? Make sure your core is strong. Now doubles. Now singles. Come on. What do you think he thinks about you? Turn your weights over. Double curl. Now listen, if you've got heavier weights or lighter weights, you can go slower or faster. The God of all gods, the King of all kings, he bought you with the blood of Jesus. Hold it here. Now out. Bring it up. Girl. Bring it forward. Upright rows. He doesn't deal with us in disappointment because he's not surprised. He deals with us by love. Now doubles. Two more. Turn it over. Hold your right. Turn your left. Hold right. I'm sorry, hold left, curl right, whichever one. The other one. Oh my gosh, this is getting really hard. Isn't it great? Hold it here. Take it out. Little pulses. Check your form. Remember, better is better. Bring it all the way down. Forward. Curl. Curl. Curl, that was great. What do you think he thinks about you? We haven't done this one in a while.
You have to know what he thinks about it. Gosh, I need to catch breath. All right, grab a second. So, this is one of the things the Lord is continually working out in me, is, is what I think can bring what he thinks. And then bringing what I agree, what I think into agreement with him. Because you cannot afford to think things about yourself, your body, your marriage, your children, your finances, that God doesn't think. So what does he think? And does what we think agree with what he thinks? This passage, I encourage you, memorize Ephesians 2, 1 through 10, because it's so important to show us where we came from and what it purchased us unto. Grab your sticks. So we're going to start with the right leg forward, three down, one up, shoulders down and back, more strong. Here we go.
Oh my gosh, this one's super fun. We're going to have to do some jumps in some time. Shoulders down the back. Elbows by your ribs. Kick. Now you want to go fast you're welcome to. So this is a burnout. So we're going to do this move and then rows. So we're highlighting the triceps. And then the muscles right behind your heart. And you doubles. Four. Three, two, hold it up. Oh, five, four, three, two, one. All right. Shoulders down the back, bend at your waist, row. Again, you can go faster. If you've got heavier, go slower. So it says, so that in the ages to come, he might show us the immeasurable riches of his grace in kindness to us through Christ. Doubles. Three. Two. Hold it up. No pulse. Four. Three. Two. One. Set it all the way up. We're going to take it above our heads. You may need to drop to one way, or you can do two. Biceps by your ears. Drop a little press up. Now, tuck your ribs in. Keep those ribs knit together. Good job. Come on. Lift the corners of your neck. He loves you and his smile is over you because of Christ Jesus. Hold it at the top. Drop it halfway. Drop it all the way. Halfway. All the way up. One more like that. Drop it halfway. All the way. Halfway. All the way up. Bring it down. Now this time, same thing for rows. We're gonna we're gonna do wider rows though. One more rows, I think you can call. So again, shoulders down and out of your ears, core is braced. Smiling with your collarbone. Now doubles. All right, bring it here. Now you're going to do a triple move. The kick back, row, wide row. Kick back, row, wide row. This is where we are to the end. Which apparently it's sooner than I thought. Aren't you glad? All right. All right, grab your lights. So he says that he might show us the immeasurable riches of his grace and kindness. For by grace you have been saved through faith. This is not your own doing, it's the gift of God. Not a result of works so that no one may boast. Isn't that fun? When we get to stretching, I'll read from the message because it's so great. Shoulders down the back. Lift laterally. Now, this is totally unrelated to Ephesians, but very related to your shoulders. When you lift with your shoulders, be kind. Your muscles, the shoulder girdle, take it to the front, is not an incredibly strong area of muscles, and it's really easy to tear them if you lift too heavy without being ready for it. So, when you do lateral movement, and frontal shoulder movement like this, go laterally, start light until you really feel that you can up it. Go to the front. All right, now, this dog won't last very long, so let's go ahead and do some arm circles. You can always drop and hold your sticks. We'll only do this once, now go back. Oh, thank you on the challenge. All right, yeah. Press your weights together here, twist. Sit into it. Now, check your knees, make sure they're not out over your toes. Now stir, stir that soup. Today's a good soup day because it's cold-ish. It's gonna be 70 this afternoon. 
raise. All right, lateral raise. Frontal raise. Two more. Engage your arms. You don't actually need weights here. All right, shake it out. Grab those weights. Press them together here. Sit low, side to side. Now stir. Keep your shoulders down and back. All right, send it all the way up. Lateral. Frontal. So by grace you were saved. Simply because he chose you because he loves you. All right, stir side to side. Oh look, the song's over. All oh, these are new, so I'm like, I don't know when they end. I don't have a sense of that yet. Okay. No class will be complete without the push-ups. So that's not true. It just means like Fridays. Fridays would not be complete without push-ups. All right. But look, listen to the pace of the song. The good song. This is the song back. All right. No push-up series today. You're gonna go very wide. To one wide. Right, to stagger. So wide to stagger. To stagger to child pose. So wide, stagger, stagger, child pose. Four of each. We're gonna go through this whole song. But God is so rich in mercy that he loved us so much that even though we were dead because of our sins, he gave us life. When he raised Christ from the dead, it is only by grace that you have been saved. For he raised us from the dead along with Christ and seated us with him in the heavenly realms because we are united with Christ Jesus. So God can point to us in all future ages as examples of the incredible wealth of his grace and kindness toward us, as shown in all he has done for us who are united in Christ Jesus. You should have your test. Good job. I was doing it, so I figured you might have been too. <laughs> Now, let's 
Put your right hip ball to the right and look over your left shoulder. Come back to center, switch sides. Oh, we did you. Okay. <laughs> How is your looking away? All right, give me a down dog. Hands up and back. Now, this skin, the way down dog is done correctly, this should actually be a rest of your arm. But if you're not finding it there, take a child's pose. If you're in down dog, pedal your feet. Come up onto your tippy toes. And press your heels towards the floor. It doesn't matter if they both touch or not. Now, let them drop to your knees, shoulders over wrists, knees under hips, cat and cow. And if you want, go and take a moment to take off your shoes. Come 
back to center. Now pull your left leg back and cross over your right. So you can be here, or if you can stack your knees, stack your knees. Wherever you are, inhale, reach up. And then exhale, walk your hands forward. So deepen your breath. Yeah. We can't do anything. You got it. We nailed it. Right there, like it. Oh. Now see if you can take your hands just an inch more forward. Oh, those hips. I love mommies. No. All right, gently walk it back up. Come back to all fours, cat and cow. Inhale and exhale. Inhale, extend that left leg and right arm. Reach long, draw your head back. Again, like you're gently pressing it into a headrest. Then take them out. Drop your toe, put your right hand back down, press those hips back. Gently bring it up. Pick up that left leg and take it across behind you. Press your hips back again. Walk your forearms over to the 
continuum and to your love and your truth that defines us right now. Pray that we would be women who know who you say we are and live according to that name. With humble confidence, knowing that you have saved us, not because of anything we've done, but because of your mercy and your kindness. Or in the places where we don't think correctly about ourselves, we do, Lord, would you bring truth to those places? That we would exchange the lies we believe for the truth that you tell us by your word. Today, Father, would you give us eyes to see those around us? Kindness, Lord, you see us. We would be quick to love, quick to share, quick to hold our tongues when needed. Your bodies are able to move in whatever way they move today. We're grateful. We sweat. Oh, God, thank you that you love us. The Lord, we love you back. Thank you for a good day. Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Amen.